Hi, it's Tim for MVP Machine. We're going to do some experimenting here today on some different materials using a Suburban Tool Fly Cutter. Um, we've got some brass. We've got some Virgin UHMW. We've got some UHMW Regrind. We've got some plain old pallet wood. And then we've got an unknown two-part polymer block. And it's kind of tough stuff. Um, we got it from a customer who used to make um, dives for commercial aircraft for the wings and body fuselages. And it was basically a two-part die and they would stamp out the aluminum pieces. This is some tough stuff it with the hammer here. Basically does nothing. Except to destroy our table. But this one we'll have to square up a little bit first before cutting it on the machine. We'll do that off camera and then we'll be right back uh, cutting each of these pieces. Okay, we're done cutting all five of these pieces. Um, we're pretty happy with the results. I'm going to go through them one at a time and show you what the finish looks like. The brass had a little bit of fuzz on it, but pretty smooth. A little bit of fuzz there. That happens, but we usually do on uh, anything. Just throw some scotch right on it. Fuzz is pretty much gone. I probably could have come up with a better feed and speed for that. However, the results are pretty good there. Okay, UHMW, Virgin UHMW, came out beautiful. Pretty much a perfect finish on that. Didn't really expect that, thought it to be, would be a little bit coarser finish but it came out really nice. <clears throat> the UHMW regrind again came out real nice pretty smooth you can see a little bit of the cutter marks in there but it is you can't feel anything in here and there's no sanding or scotch writing this stuff it is what it is. The wood it's actually pretty amazing. I thought this was going to be the one we had a problem with and aside from not going deep enough to clean up this rough area here, the wood looks beautiful. Mystery material, same result. We went pretty deep on the depths of cut but didn't clean up where all the bubbles are from casting the stuff but a nice flat perfect finish on that aside from bubbles. Uh, if you have any materials you'd like to see us cut with this cutter, drop us a message in the <coughs> message area below. And thank you for watching our videos.